I think this tracking shot is hilarious. We momentarily see this very weird short trooper almost camouflage into the concrete barrier. He's most likely had a traumatic brain injury playing Smash Ball or something. I mean, just look at the way he talks. What do you think you're doing? Excuse me? You keep looking around. Just trying to figure out what's going on. You were part of it. You were part of it? I, I swear, I thought the short trooper was about to say, you know, something cheesy like... You were part of it. The revolution? The dance revolution and all of his buddies would just start dancing in the background. It's almost surreal, this entire scene. Especially when it's juxtaposed with all of these vacationers in this slightly messed up and funky resort town. But there's a reason why it feels like this. The awkwardness isn't just manufactured as always the lore tells the truth. The short troopers were actually created for Rogue One, written by Tony Gilroy, so it's fitting that they make a return in Andor. These are not normal soldiers though. They are actually a specialized unit within the Stormtrooper legions, making them elite vanguard units. This is why the scene is so weird. But I'm not running. You got that right. Remember guys, the galaxy is in a transitional period up until now, and the Haisan Aldani has sped up things drastically. Up until now, there was either no security or just local corporate security like we see on Morlana or regular security, or maybe the Imperial Army, who are far more relaxed than the stormtroopers, but after the heist, now the ISB is in charge and they're going heavy on law enforcement. Any criminal act with even indirect effect on the Empire, will henceforth be branded our Class 1 offense. But of course, they don't have the people to really do it, so they call the Shore Troopers in. These guys were recruited for the fanaticism, physical stature, and strength, but not necessarily for their brain cells. I mean, look, I love Tarman, but this was a stupid Stormtrooper move when he tried to run and save Vel. People are like, oh no, Skeet messed up and didn't cover fire. He did try, but he got pinned down by this dude up top who had an excellent firing position. Tarman should have used that small window skein bought him by advancing and going to another firing position, not running straight in a line in the open. But this is how stormtroopers think, even the good ones. And so the fact that the Empire is using them for policing citizens is going to cause a lot of problems like this. I mean, that one courtroom is probably full of people that these paranoid troopers thought were looking sketchy but we're actually not doing anything. You gotta think about it. Shore troopers and stormtroopers are trained to operate in hostile areas where they see threats in every direction. You should not be placing them on a beach. This is why in America, we have trained law enforcement officers and not army rangers and marines patrolling the boardwalks. These are completely different skill sets. 